Hello, I'm Brent Ferris from the Bearded Man Studios, and I'm back to give you a little bit more of visual scripting goodness. This one's main point is to switch you between levels, from one level to another. But you'll get some other cool stuff in here, such as rotations and whatever else. Uh, but the main purpose is to get level switching. So, first things first, I have two levels here. I have move stuff and menu stuff. I'm currently on menu stuff. I'll press Control shift b to bring up the build settings. I'll drag menu stuff in first and then move stuff. I guess the order doesn't really matter. It's up to you. But I need both of those in there, or at least just move stuff. So my scene I'm going to, I need to have. And what I want to do is take this object here, this cube, and drag it into my uh, uScript editor. So from here, I want to create an update. So I'm going to type in update, and there's a global update. And I'm going to type in uh, rotate. Let's see, we should have a rotate here. Do, do, do. I'm going to go to the input of the update, drag it in the cube as the target, and the degrees, uh, make it two. Oh, that's not a two. Two axis seconds. Hmm. This may not be the rotate I want. Here we go. This is the rotate I want. Sorry about that. Let's drag that into the update, this into the instance, and let's just do one, two, three. And save out my debug. I'm going to call this uh, level beep, 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 beep. Sorry about that. I'm going to type in uh, level uh, demo. There we go. Yes. Level demo is a little vague. But there we go. It's compiling out. Do, 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 do. All right, there we go. That was my little bit of song. Let's make sure it's spinning. And it's spinning. Okay, cool. So now when I click on this cube, I want to switch levels. So what I'm going to do is do a um, cursor. So the mouse cursor events. The instance is going to be this cube. Uh, yes. And what I want to do is load level. So load level. Or just type in load. Here it is, load level. Um, and then on mouse down, I want to load the level. What was it called? It's called move stuff. So I'm going to type in move stuff. Exactly how it's spelled down here. So uh, on click of this cube, I want to load the level move stuff. So I'm going to save debug, compile that out. Just going to close uScript because I don't need it anymore. I'll press play. When I click down on this guy, I switch scenes and now I'm in that sphere scene where it moves slower when it goes into this object, if you remember. So uh, again, I'll just hit play. There's my cube. Click and it goes into the scene where we have the slow zone. So that's how we're able to switch levels on uh, mouse down. Uh, later on in the series, I will probably be going over uh, tutorials on how to extend uScript. It's, uh, and I want to add an on-click down here so that we can do an on-click to this object so we know that the mouse is down and up. Um, but that's probably, I could have probably left that out of this whole tutorial. But expect future updates on videos on how to expand uScript to do cool stuff that it doesn't have. Um, and it's pretty easy to do. Anybody can do it, even if you're not uh, super knowledgeable of programming. So until then, uh, thanks for watching, and I will uh, teach again sometime soon.